The Manoline, Portuguese, Estilo Manolino, IPA, Delunino, or Portuguese Late Gothic, is the sumptuous, composite Portuguese style of architectural ornamentation of the first decades of the 16th century, incorporating maritime elements and representations of the discoveries brought from the voyages of Vasco da Gama and Pedro Alvarez Cabral. This innovative style synthesizes aspects of late Gothic architecture with influences of the Spanish Plateresque style, Mudager, Italian urban architecture, and Flemish elements. It marks the transition from late Gothic to Renaissance. The construction of churches and monasteries in Manoline was largely financed by proceeds of the lucrative spice trade with Africa and India. The style was given its name, many years later, by Francisco Adolfo de Varnhagen, Viscount of Porto Seguro. In his 1842 book, Noticia Historica e Descriptiva do Mastero de Balam, Calmum Glossario de Various Termas Respectivis Principimenta Architectura Gothica, in his description of the Geronimus Monastery, Varnhagen named the style after King Manuel I, whose reign, 1495-1521, coincided with its development. The style was much influenced by the astonishing successes of the voyages of discovery of Portuguese navigators, from the coastal areas of Africa to the discovery of Brazil and the ocean routes to the Far East, drawing heavily on the style and decorations of East Indian temples. Although the period of this style did not last long, from 1490 to 1520, it played an important part in the development of Portuguese art. The influence of the style outlived the king. Celebrating the newly maritime power, it manifested itself in architecture, churches, monasteries, palaces, castles, and extended into other arts such as sculpture, painting, works of art made of precious metals, faience and furniture.